Hi, I'm Jonathan from Franklin and Psychworks. Today I'm going to show you how to replace the chain on your road bike. Now the first thing we're going to want to do is buy a new chain. And to do that, we need to know how many speeds your bike has. This has six in the rear and two up front. But what we're really interested in is a six back here. So we're going to buy a chain that can accommodate six gears. Generally that'll be a, a six, seven, eight speed chain. Now the next thing you're going to want to know is the width of the chain. You're probably going to have to ask the guy at the bike shop for this. Um, generally with these old speed road bikes, it's one and one eighth. Sometimes you'll run into three thirty seconds. So check with the bike shop about that. Now the next thing we're going to want to do after we've bought the chain is actually take off the old one. To do this, we're going to use what's called a chain brake. This kind pushes out the pin between links. We're actually going to take a link and fit it within the grooves back here, as you can see. It's lined up so that the pin will be able to be pushed out by this piston. You just screw it into position. Make sure that the chain is resting inside the groove nice and tight. And then you slowly put tension on the chain brake, forcing out the pin. You're going to want to do this slowly to make sure that you're not causing any damage to the chain. Okay, once you've pushed the pin almost all the way out, you can release the tension, take the piston out, and the chain will just fall apart. So now, we're going to install the new chain. We're actually going to thread this chain on so that it's on the biggest cog back here and the biggest chain ring up front. That'll be the maximum length of the chain that we need in order for this bike to function. So we're going to set our derailleurs to accommodate that. And then you thread the chain on. Now when you're threading the chain through the derailleur, you want to pay special attention to how you go through the derailleur. It's kind of common sense, but unless you've done it before, it can be a little confusing. You want to come around the first wheel, through the derailleur cage, and around the back side of the bottom wheel. Alright, so this chain is already as short as we want it. We couldn't go any shorter than this. Now, before we try and put the chain back together, we're going to take the tension off of it, and so we're actually going to bring the chain back down into the smallest cog in the rear and the smallest chain ring up front. All right. Now we're ready to put our chain back together. The chain actually comes with the pin still in the link. We're just going to slide one end of the link into the end containing the pin, like so. Now because that pin's in there a little bit, it'll actually hold the chain. To push the pin back in place, we're going to do basically the opposite of what we did before. Again, we're going to rest the link inside the groove. We're going to make sure that it's nice and tight in there. But this time, rather than pushing the pin out, we're going to use the little piston to push the pin back in. Again, you're going to want to do this slowly and carefully to make sure you don't do any damage to the links of the chain. Now the chain is completely together, but most likely, the link is a little bit stiff. To release the stiffness, you just kind of work the link with your fingers. Once the link is nice and loose, you're all done. I'm Jonathan from Franklin and PsychoWorks, and I hope this lesson has been helpful in teaching you how to replace the chain on your road bike.